Hey, welcome back to Creative Skills Club. It is I, Diego, and I am joined by these two, Sebastian and Addy. And today we are here in beautiful Julian, California. It's a beautiful day out, and we just heard the quail outside. There's quail everywhere here. These are California quail that I'm talking about. And we know they're around even when we don't see them because they make a very unique sound. You're very good at making that sound, aren't you? Can you do it? Yeah. <laughs> He's so good at making that sound that the quail even respond back to him. That's how we can find him. He calls them and then they call back. Well, anyway, today the quail are going to be the inspiration for today's drawing. And Sebastian here is going to teach the drawing. And Addie's going to be the student. I'm going to step out of this one and leave it to them. Uh, today you will need your pencil. We're going to do a pencil drawing first, then ink it, and finally color it in markers. So let's get started. Okay. So first on the California quail, we're going to draw, not in the middle, but a little to the side, a small line right there, straight. Make it a little more straight up. Okay. Okay, there. Then we're going to do a big curve line like that. A big curve line. Okay. That's how long. Okay, and then make it round at the end. And then go all the way around like that. So it'll be kind of like this. So let's go like that and then... Yeah, make it, try to make it really skinny. I need this eraser. Really skinny right there. And then bigger at the end. It's skinny. And then go. Yes. Okay. And then do a small, like, straight and then curve. Like that. So straight. And then. No. Okay, make it come out and then curve. Look what I did. Come out and then curve. No. Okay, see? So I raise that. Okay. Make it come out and then curve like that. Okay, and then once you're done with that, make it a little point. Do a little point. Do like do exactly like you. Yes, do what I'm doing. Down. Okay, and then go curve it and then down like that. Actually make a little more curved in. Okay. And make it at the same like a little curved that. in right here. Like the same and line as that. Down, go curve down and then down. down. And once you're done with that, come back up to here and make it a little bit straight and then come down like that. You're making the head of the quill. You can kind of see it now. Oh, yeah, I see you. Okay. So next, once you're done with that, come out a little and then a big line around and stop there. I think that made mine a little too long. I'm doing. I'm making a baby, okay. so it's gonna be like a small little guy. Hey. Erase it. That's pretty good, but you gotta erase it right there because the legs are gonna be coming out from there. Okay. So here's the eraser. Erase it here. Yeah. Okay. Because your legs are gonna be right there. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's good. And then that, now we're going to do the eyes and the beak. So first you have to do the beak. Come in and out like that. Okay, in and out. Yeah. And then go straight and then go like that. Straight. Do I can see? Oh, yeah. Um, Wait, I got to get the earrings here. Like that? It's kind of like that, like curved. They're both curved. 
Yeah, yeah. that's good. And then once you're done with that, the eyes, they're kind of right behind the beak right there. So start it from there. And do it like that. <laughs> Whoa, that's a big eye. Mm-hmm. I'm coloring yet. That'll be in the inking stage. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. So next, once you're done with that, we're going to do the back line and then the feet. Okay. So once you're done with this neck, go straight out that way. And then once it's like uh, right across, go down. Like a little slant <laughs> down like this. Yeah. And then we're going to do the tail. So the tail is just come back in, straight line. And you could do scruffy feathers, clean feathers, whatever you want. I'm going to do mine just regular tail feathers. So then from your line right there, come in like that. I already uh, um, did the in. Okay, good. So then we're going to do the feet. One foot is coming back like that. And curve around, and the other foot is right there. Mm-hmm. So it's gonna go like that. To go back, and then. So then. kind of like a bridge. Like if that was the top of the bridge, and this is the bottom of the bridge. And the you need more lead. Pop this out a little bit. There you go. Huh. that? Yeah, that's pretty good. Okay. So once you're done doing the little things right there, come in and make like a little feather lines like that. And that's where the legs are going to start. Yeah. And this one's going to curve straight down, and this one is going to curve forward a little bit. Straight down, and it kind of forward. Okay. Okay, next you want to do the feet or the face patterns? Mm. Feet. Okay, so the feet. First you have to figure out where your ground is going to be. The ground is going to be right I'm there right on mine. There. Okay, yeah. and draw the back toes, curve down like that. Uh, I'm at your feet. Maybe my ground a little bit higher. Maybe right there. Okay. And then the back toes. Back toes, back toes. Okay, once you have those two lines right there, come in and up. And you could draw your little nail. Okay. In and up. In a minute. Um, it's like it's walking in air. You should put your ground right under the feet like that. Maybe I should do it under the feet. Let's see yours. It could be running and above the ground. Just gonna go this way. This. Mm, that. Okay. So once you do that, come in like that and then straight out. Come in, down, and straight out. Okay, then? Okay. And then do your little toes. You can do one bump and the other toes. That. Take your nail. Okay. 
and then do yeah, the little nails you already did it. So do that on both feet. Go like that and like that and then dry your nails. Okay. Now we're gonna do the face patterns. The face patterns are my favorite part. So we're gonna come like that, make it a little, not a straight line, a little bit curved and like feathery like that. Like kind of scruffy. Okay. Okay. So once you're finished with your little scruffy line that comes to the, so these, they kind of meet up at the same thing like that. It's kind of like curve and then big curve. Mm. Yeah, you're you're good. Okay, and we're gonna do kind of the same one. It's gonna be like this, but this one's gonna curve all the way down. So same scruffy little line that comes all the way down like this. Okay. Okay, so you can just do a line right there so you remember where your colors change. That's going to be a black part, and that's going to be there. So now we're going to do the eyeballs. So first do a little eye shine. Now you're just doing that, so you don't need to do this. I'm going to do my eyeball because I think they look cuter like that. And there's a little eye shine. And then we're going to do the mouth. The quills, they kind of look like they're smiling. That's going to make it look cuter, right? Mm -hmm. So where this curve is, that's going to be the start of the mouth. Yeah, that's kind of good. Yeah. So come down and then up. Like that. Okay. Okay. So we have the body. Now we're going to do the wings. So the wings are really easy. You kind of just draw a straight line like that. Mine is a little too close to the breast. So it comes like that. And then go like, curve around and then in. So it's kind of like a teardrop, but instead of having round, it's gonna be one side of a teardrop straight. Okay, so we're going to do the feathers. I drew it light so I could still draw in the feathers. It's going to be the same kind of thing as the tail. Do one big feather and then kind of get smaller. You could do a little like that. Okay. So the rest of the patterns are going to be here. But we're going to do that once we are coloring. They're just, you can do little light lines like that. Okay, so just do your little patterns right here. Little patterns, like that. And we're also gonna do little lines on the wings, but that's, we're gonna do all that in the coloring stage. Okay, now it's time to ink. You ready to ink? Time to ink.
joining us in this episode. We had fun drawing California clothes. I hope you did too. See you next time. Thank you for joining us. Bye. <laughs>